Chop's Grill is a specialty restaurant located on various rural Caribbean ships offering upscale steakhouse dining for both lunch and dinner. The restaurant prides itself on having a sophisticated atmosphere with elegant decor and is one of the most popular dining options on any cruise ship. At Chop's Grill, patrons can enjoy a diverse selection of dishes including cuts of beef, fresh seafood, and other delicious items. Hey guys, I'm Marquise Colton and you guys are watching Dumb Coltons where we give you guys cruise tips, tricks, and even vlogs. And today I'm giving you guys a detailed overview of Chop's Grill's dinner menu so you guys can have an idea of what to expect and decide if it's the right restaurant for you. I never went to Chop's Grill personally myself, but I wanted to look at the menu and, and I thought of the idea of making a video where I show the whole menu and all their foods so we could both look at it and see exactly what they have on there and if it's good for us. I'm gonna go through the whole menu showing you guys different pictures of the different dishes and let you guys know exactly what you guys want to get. Now this is a sample menu so it's not gonna be on every single Royal Caribbean ship with a Chop's Grill but this is a good idea of what to expect if you go to a Chop's Grill. So let's get right into it. So first we're gonna go over all of the appetizers. So for the solo appetizers we have the Colossal Shrimp Cocktail that has horseradish cocktail sauce with lemon, tuna tartar with avocado, ginger, and wasabi caviar, jumbo lump crab cake that includes chipotle aioli, charred beef carpaccio that includes rare charred beef, parmesan cheese, arugula, and truffle mustard dressing, and lastly grilled black pepper bacon which is slow cooked Berkshire pork with a sweet and spicy glaze. So that's it for the appetizers, let's move on to the soups and salads. They have a wild mushroom soup that is scented with white truffle oil and chives, a lobster bisque which is brandy with a tarragon cream, a Caesar salad with romaine shaved parmesan tossed in caesar dressing and fresh baked croutons a crispy goat cheese salad that consists of green apples candied walnuts cranberries and balsamic dressing and then the wedge which is an iceberg lettuce with blue cheese crumbles and smoked bacon now we're going to go into the main dining sections and first we're going to go with the meats and poultry first is their filet which is a nine ounce cut of their midwestern beef next is their petite filet which is a smaller six ounce cut but equally as tender and delicious as the nine ounce filet they have a Prime bone-in ribeye, which is described to be a USDA prime 16 ounce bone-in cut that is well marbled with peak flavor. Next is the prime New York strip, which is a 12 ounce full flavored USDA prime cut with a slightly firmer texture than the ribeye. Next is the rack of lamb, which is a tender oven roasted rack of lamb seasoned with thyme and rosemary. And last on the meats and poultry list is the organic roasted chicken, which is half chicken slowly roasted, perfectly seasoned with thyme served with al juice. Al juice, al juice. I'll just, I, I never heard that one before. Now for the seafood, they have a grilled branzino, which is sauteed with spinach, olive oil, lemon, and sea salt. They have a spicy jumbo shrimp, which include red pepper flakes and creamy garlic butter. They have a grilled Italian salmon that includes whole grain mustard sauce. And lastly, a broiled half pound Maine lobster, which has drawn butter and fresh lemon. With all of these main dishes, you have the option of choosing a shareable portion of sides that includes Gruyere cheese tater tots, cream spinach, mac and cheese, sauteed mushrooms, grilled jumbo asparagus, Yukon gold mashed potatoes, truffle french fries, and a salted baked potato. If you have some dietary needs, they also have gluten-free, lactose-free, and vegetarian options that are available for all guests if they need it. So if you have one of these dietary needs, you can talk to your waiter and they'll give it to you. Now for desserts. They have a chocolate mud pie, which is a homemade Mississippi favorite, a liquid center chocolate banana cake with coconut ice cream, a red velvet cake with homemade sweet cream cheese frosting, huckleberry cheesecake with double crumb crust, citrus, and mountain huckleberries, a warm cookie plate with a variety of different flavors of cookies, such as chocolate chip, white chocolate, coconut cranberry, or oatmeal, and lastly, an assorted ice cream and sorbet. So guys, that was a full deep dive into the Chops Grill menu. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys would actually go here or if you guys have gone here, tell me your favorite dishes in the comments below. Also, if you guys have any other menu you guys want to know about, let me know in the comments below as well. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, make sure to click that like button and we we'll hope to see you guys next time on Dumb Coltons. Peace.